my breakfast. It's like a TikTok thing. But channel happy vlogmas day six today i am showing you guys what i eat in a day it's been a very long time since i've done a what i eat in a day i think it's been at least a good two months maybe even longer i feel like maybe even three it's been a really long time so i figured i would update you guys on what i am eating <laughs> in a typical day so yeah today i'm just going to take you through my day today i'm just working at my internship so i don't have any classes or anything until later tonight so i'm going to take you through what i'm having for breakfast lunch, snacks, and dinner today. So yeah, if you guys are new to my channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe to see more videos like this. And obviously, I'm doing Vlogmas. So there is a ton of content this month. So yeah, like literally a ton. It's kind of crazy. So yeah, anyway, welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. We're almost the first week through Vlogmas, which is kind of crazy. Still got a lot to go. So yeah, anyway, you guys saw this morning that I filled up my water bottle. That's always the first thing I do in the morning is I fill up my water bottle and have like as much as I can. I can't drink a full like water bottle in the morning like or like when I first wake up. So I do that just to kind of flush out my system. Then I obviously make coffee because I literally can't function without coffee. I just have to have like one cup a day. That's all I really need. So Anyway, you guys saw that I have a, an espresso machine. I'll have that linked um, in my Amazon shop page as well. I get a ton of questions about my coffee maker and it's just an espresso machine. It's like the Virtuo line, I believe it is. So yeah, I just did that. So it was just like a regular coffee with some frothed milk. I didn't do anything fancy, didn't add anything today. Most days I just keep it simple. I don't add like unnecessary sugars or creamers or anything like that. So I try and keep it like pretty healthy. <laughs> so yeah, I had that this morning and I like to really just sit and drink my coffee and kind of like wake up and I've already started doing work. I've been working for about an hour now and it's about 8.30 now. Oh, I've been working for like an hour and a half. So <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I like to really like take my time before I go ahead and have breakfast. I can't just like eat right away. So now that it's 8.30, I'm going to go ahead and make some breakfast. I'm going to be making some oatmeal. I haven't had oatmeal in a very long time just because I like cycle through things but now that it's winter I feel like it's the perfect time to have oatmeal so I'm going to be showing you guys how I make my oatmeal this morning and it is very easy <laughs> so I'll show you guys that and yeah then I'm just gonna carry on with the work day and then I'll show you guys what I'm having later for a snack so yeah let's go make some breakfast I'm literally starved <laughs> I just did some oatmeal, some chocolate protein powder, which is actually Justin's protein powder, and just a couple of frozen berries. So there's some um, strawberries, raspberries, blackberries, I believe, like maybe one or two, and then some blueberries. So this is breakfast for today. So normally with my oatmeal, I would just do like regular oatmeal and then just put like berries in it or something, maybe like a bit of honey. But today I decided to add the chocolate protein powder because Justin had that yesterday and it honestly like smelled really good and kind of chocolatey. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to try it today. So I'm going to do a little taste test and let me 
I'll let you guys know how, what I think of it. I'm not a big fan of like protein powder, so we'll see. That's really good. That's like really, really good. I really like that. And then I'm not sure if I showed you guys, but I added in a little bit more milk and then put this back um, with the berries in for another 30 seconds just to make sure everything was mixed and just added a bit more milk just because it was looking a little dry with the protein powder. So I wanted it to be not super dry and like hard or anything like that. So that is what I'm having for breakfast today. I am going to be doing some work now, but also I wanted to say that I know the, so I know the um, oatmeal I use is not the healthiest. It's just the like uh, Quaker Oats, like quick and easy, like, you know, put it in for two minutes and it's ready. So I would suggest um, if you really want to make it healthy, just use like steel cut oats or something like that. It's obviously healthier for you. And this obviously is low sugar, but it still has sugar in it. So if you want it to be even healthier, you could do that and just like, add honey to sweeten it. But obviously this was like maple sugar or brown sugar and maple or something like that. So it is sweeter, but I mean, personally, like I don't eat a lot of sugar during the day. So I feel like this is the one time that I'll like have some sugar. So I'm not really fussed about it. So that's what we just do. It's just honestly easier than doing like the regular oats. Um, it probably saves like not even that much time, but that's just what we normally do. So yeah, this is what breakfast looks like for today. So it looks super good. So I'm gonna eat this, get some work done, and I'll talk to you when it's time to snack later in the day. <laughs> everyone I just wrapped up all of my morning meetings it's now 11 a.m. I'm going to be having a little snack so one thing I've been loving for snacks is this thing that technically it's like a TikTok thing but I didn't find it from TikTok I can't remember who I found it out from I think maybe like Instagram or something like that but it's so yummy so I'm going to be cutting up some pepper putting some cream cheese on it and some everything but the bagel seasoning. It's not like a, rib, a very filling snack, but that's perfectly fine <laughs> for me. It's just something to just munch on, um, just cause I'm a little bit hungry now. It's been a couple of hours since breakfast. So yeah, anyway, it's, yeah, it's just after 11. So I'm probably gonna have an early lunch at like 12 or 12.30. So I don't want a big snack anyway. So I'm gonna go do that. Justin's just in some meetings right now. So I'm just gonna do like a little time lapse of me making my snack. Um, but I just told you everything that was in it anyway. And it's super easy and simple to make. And it's very yummy actually. I highly recommend you try it because I know Justin was like, oh, it doesn't sound good, but it honestly is like very, very nice. So let's go and make that. Looking for me till it's gone. Take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no. Lay me down behind the moon. Tell me you'll be on real soon. I don't wanna wait no. We could be dancing in the stars. We could be floating on a lake. As long as I'm safely in your arms. And it don't really matter where we stay Don't ask me Space makes me sad making some lunch right now so I'm just gonna be having some leftovers that's mostly what I have for like every single lunch it's mostly just leftovers from the night before because it's just the easiest thing to do and then you're using up everything so I'm just gonna be making a taco bowl for today's lunch so I've just got some ground beef some rice I'm gonna heat that up and then I'm going to be topping it with some red pepper, green pepper, and onions in here, some cheese, some non-fat Greek yogurt. This is what I use as a substitution for sour cream and it tastes exactly the same. Um, some jalapenos, because I like things very spicy. And then just to top it all off with some sriracha, since like I said, I like things really spicy. So I'm just gonna be putting all of this in a bowl, heat it up, and that's lunch. Simple as that. <laughs> So here is today's lunch. It looks super good. I love taco bowls. I just love like Mexican food in general. So yeah, rice, some black beans, some beef, Greek yogurt, 
cheese, some veggies and onions, jalapenos, and some sriracha. And that is the final product. Everyone, so it is now 6.30 and Justin and I are just making some dinner. We're just making some lemon pepper chicken. So, let me show you. So we've just got some lemon pepper chicken just baking in the oven. And I'm about to make a very easy salad. It's a, a very cheating way to make a salad. So let me grab it. So we use these salad kits literally all the time. It's just an easy way to make a salad. It's literally just in a bag and you throw it in and then you're ready to go. And that's pretty much our dinner for the night. So let me show you guys. So tonight we're just gonna be having the Caesar salad. We've also had the Asian salad and that's really good too. It's just romaine lettuce, parmesan, Caesar dressing, black pepper, and some croutons. So this is just a great way if you are someone like me who just finished work, edited a video, and then had another class. So I literally just got out of class. So if you don't have time, this is just an easy, quick fix to have a salad. Obviously, it's probably healthier to just make it yourself and not use like a, a creamy dressing. But I mean, this is just a simple way to just have salad and then throw some chicken in. We're just baking it and it just bakes for about 20 minutes. So simple. is the final product a simple healthy easy meal to make at home so just some baked chicken with lemon pepper it's my favorite way to eat chicken it's honestly the best seasoning you can put on chicken and then a little Caesar salad or not really a little salad but yeah and then Justin's just having the same thing but with a dinner roll as well I just made myself some peppermint tea, just something I like to have in the winter and the colder months. I'm gonna put this down because I'm probably gonna burn myself holding it and talking to the camera at the same time. So yeah, anyway, that pretty much wraps up everything that I typically eat in a day. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. It was very like realistic, easy, simple meals that were on like the healthier side. I wouldn't say they were like the healthiest meals ever, but they were definitely like easy, healthy meals. So I hope you guys got some inspiration from this. And yeah, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you did, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I will see you all in tomorrow's video. So until then, bye guys. <laughs>